Welcome to this introduction to the Spatial Sound Card. Adapted from our professional product line, the Spatial Sound Card is a software-based sound card that provides a virtual loudspeaker system for stereo and surround sound for any computer, but just using regular headphones. The Spatial Sound Card is installed as a virtual sound card application and becomes the standard audio device of the computer. It works with all applications that support stereo and surround audio output. These include games and media players like iTunes, Netflix, VLC, as well as the main output of your operating system. And as a real high quality speaker environment, it just sounds great. So let's have a tour on the parameters of the spatial sound card. First, there are solo and mute controls to check the sound of each virtual loudspeaker separately. The level of each virtual loudspeaker can be adjusted individually. A double click on the knob resets the level. In the settings menu, a lot of individual adjustments can be made. You can select the format for the spatial sound card. This is the output selector of the spatial sound card where you can allocate the output device. And this knob adjusts its master level. On the top, you can see the latency and sample rate of the selected device. Here you can find a brief overview of the parameters. The latency target selector lets you suit the latency of the spatial sound card to the abilities of your internal or external audio hardware and CPU usage. The so-called locations are the different virtual loudspeaker environments. These environments origin from the measurements of real professional sound studios and provide a very natural and realistic being there sound impression. The urban backgrounds indicate the different locations that can be selected by taste to experience your game, your movie or your music like you never heard before. The presets are great out of the box. Nonetheless, here you can tune the spatial appearance of your virtual loudspeaker system by adjusting the envelope and fit the sound to your headphones. You can always bypass the virtualization to listen to the standard stereo sound of your source. The interface is scalable to save screen space. In the compact view, you can access the main parameters of the spatial sound card. An additional parameter menu is available in the menu bar. This is where you can exit the spatial sound card. On computers with Mac OS, you will find the additional parameter menu in the top menu bar. So that's it. Now you have a brief overview of the spatial sound card and all of its functionality. Don't forget to watch our other videos to hear the spatial sound card in action.